Remade is a project that we have been doing in our program over 10 years. And essentially, it is intercepting industrial scrap uh, before it heads to the landfill and creating marketable products from that scrap. We've added an entrepreneurial factor to this project where the students must create 20 of these objects and then retail them at a local venue. The first assignment is, is dumpster diving and the students must bring in uh, half a dozen different types of materials and we spend a week brainstorming on what the potential products could spring from these materials. You name it, we've seen it. Um, I, I tell the students, go to a rope factory and see what's in their, their garbage. And if there's hundreds of pieces of six inches, six inch pieces of rope, um, you know, what can you do with that? There have been many products created throughout the life of this project, uh, some of which have won awards. In fact, one student has actually created a small cottage industry on her uh, recycled car vinyl upholstery, which she has turned into beautiful handbags. Uh, what's amazing about the Remade project, which I also call Trash to Cash, is that students will literally take an idea and fabricate a product, you know, from concept to store shelf. They will have the full experience of the product development process. And although it's a, sh a short time frame, uh, by keeping the product simple, they are literally are able to do this entire process within a quarter, which is uh, 10 weeks, and usually less than that. So they, they learn, number one, material acquisition, how to get a, a constant, steady supply of materials, how to fabricate their product, uh, not to mention the whole design process of, of creatively coming up with an idea, but how to, how to fabricate it, coming up with a manufacturing plan, having a quality assurance or quality control over their products. It will actually function and the uh, ultimate customer will be happy with, with the, um, the use of it. The students also learn a little bit about marketing. Uh, each, each student must come up with a name, a hang tag, and a little story about their product, which is conveyed at the point of purchase. So all these factors, including pricing, uh, many of these are actually new to the students. Although they are all expert shoppers um, and have all been in retail environments as the customer, now they're uh, seeing the other side of the counter, if you will, and experiencing, um, you know, w w what do customers like? What, what are the trends today, um, what can inspire or uh, inspire a customer to, to pay for this object that was designed from trash. Um, most of the students have been very successful in completing that assignment um, and have, you know, many stories can be told about, you know, pricing something too high or too low. Or, or missing the mark, missing the target market, uh, not really creating a product that anyone wants. And so because of the nature of the retail environment, the relationship we have, we have been able to adjust things uh, mid-course. So students can change the prices, students can uh, maybe ch alter the product a little bit to make it uh, more marketable, etc. So it's a great, it's a great experience, um, again, from concept to store shelf and making that essentially the American dream in a mini version uh, that incorporates sustainability, uh, making that happen.